Hello. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add items to your scene in Figuro. Figuro has a bunch of different items you can use in your scene, and they are found in the items part of the toolbox, in the upper right corner of the designer, right here. You can add cubes, rectangles, cylinders, spheres, grids, polylines and point lights to your scene easily, and additional items like directional lights and point lights will be added to Figaro in the future. To add an item to your scene, select it from the toolbox and this will set Figaro in create mode. Here I have selected the cube. The create properties of the item will be shown in the lower right corner. These properties are used when creating the item. Right here you can see the cube settings and I can change them in whatever I like. You can play with these properties to see what effect they have on creating the item, but for now let's leave those properties as they are and add an item using default values. To add the item to your scene, simply click and drag in any view. Let's add a cube. As you can see, the cube is created. I can do so in any view and with any object I like. So let's add a cylinder. Or a sphere. As I add those new items to my scene, I see them listed in the Scene Explorer on the left side as well, over here. To select an object, simply click on it in any view or select it in the Scene Explorer, like this. When an item is selected, you can see its properties in the lower left corner of the Scene Explorer, right here. Here you can op make objects invisible or change their name, like this. And that's actually all there is to it. So to add a new item, simply select it in the toolbox, adjust the create properties, and then click and drag in any view. There are a few special cases though, and polylines are one of them. You don't click and drag to create a polyline, but instead you point and click to add new points to the polyline and Double-click to create the last point of the polyline. You can do that in any view, like this. Click, 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 double-click. Again, click, 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 double-click. As, as we've seen before, selecting an object is done by clicking on it in any view. However, adding new points to a polyline is done by clicking in any view too. So if I start clicking now again while the polyline item is still active, which it is, I'm starting a new polyline. If I want to select one of these polylines, I first need to go into edit mode. And I can do so by selecting one of the tools in the toolbox, like move, for example. This will deactivate the polyline item. And now I can click on the polyline to select it, like this. The same is done for point lights. Simply add a point light by selecting it in the toolbox and clicking in any view, like this. To select the point light, again select one of the tools first, like move, and then click on the point light, like this. And there you go. Now you know how to add new items to your scene in Figaro. Happy modeling and hope to see you next time.